Ho, 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 ho. No, don't worry. It's not Christmas just yet. You haven't been in lockdown for nine months, even if it does feel like it. It's only the 16th of April. But to celebrate this wonderful day, we've got your very latest Paris Saint-Germain red and blue news flash in English. As you know, Paris Saint-Germain is doing everything in this fight against COVID-19 and the club has even gone as far as giving the Parc des Princes a facelift to pay tribute to and encourage all those working so hard so that the rest of our lives can be as normal as possible during this difficult period. A week ago, on the 9th of April, Paris Saint-Germain opened its stadium doors to various charities and institutions. 60 volunteers from the Street Food in Movement charity have been cooking away in the kitchens at the Parc des Princes, preparing fresh meals for Paris hospital staff and delivering them in their four food trucks. The whole thing financed by the sale of 1,500 special edition Paris Saint-Germain jerseys that has already seen more than 5,000 fresh meals for hospital staff in the French capital and will see five times that delivered in the coming weeks. And finally, the Action Against Hunger charity has occupied the Boulogne stand to stock protective material so that its volunteers can come each and every day to the Parc des Princes to make both adult and child hygiene kits for the most needy all across the country. It's official, Paris Saint-Germain are the French handball champions of 2020. The French Handball League voted on Tuesday to cancel the remaining eight rounds of the league season, which means Paris Saint-Germain are Lidl star league champions with 35 points, six more than second place Nantes. Les Rouges et Bleus becoming the first club ever to win the league six years in a row. And even if it's not how we imagined it would be, and even if the celebrations have been put on ice until after the lockdown, well done to our latest champions. It is fully deserved. And if you want to hear from our footballers today, our former France international left-back Laure Boulot invited Paris fan Maxime to share a video call with Marquinhos. The Brazilian defender chatted about his lockdown experience so far in a lovely chat as part of the All at Home series with club partner All Accord Live Limitless. Check it out on psg.fr. Oui, profite deux enfants, on est papa 24 heures sur 24 heures. <laughs> C'est pas trop dur avec les enfants. Instead of just waiting around for Christmas to come, let's make the most of this situation to improve our football knowledge and in particular for you younger ones out there to brush up on Paris Saint-Germain's illustrious past as if you were there. Like some of us were. Tonight at 9pm we've got charles Edouard Corridon scoring the most amazing Champions League goal you'll see against the then reigning European champions Porto. It's coming up tonight on PSG TV, Paris Saint-Germain vs Porto from 2004. Follow it on the app or on the website psg.fr. And then on Saturday night, your homeschooling at the Red and Blue Online Institute for Football Studies continues. We see how the Rouge et Bleu club won its first ever trophy in the utterly epic 1982 Coupe de France final against Michel Platini's Saint-Étienne. That's on Saturday on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook and Twitch. I can hardly wait. That will do for us today. Remember, we know it's not easy, but to get back to the Parc des Princes and watching football as quickly as possible, you all need to do your bit. Stay safe, stay at home and wash your hands. Isn't that right? Edinson Cavani. Como país sabemos lo que es trabajar en equipo, que sabemos lo que es trabajar por el otro y hoy es un momento donde tenemos que pensar así, por nosotros, por todos.